Who was it? Which one of you malfunctioning pukes? It was you, wasn't it? Six months in the gas mines for all of you. Someone's career in defacing restroom walls is over. And for the record, my mother has no dick for you to punch her in. But six months, sir, come on. We're the best deck crew on the station. What I'm hearing is that you're not accustomed to the kind of hard leadership that keeps the galaxy in order. You know, the gas mines will do you good. How do you think I made lieutenant at my age? You see, I was once mistaken about a great many things. <laughs> lieutenant Tennis. Dark Lord. <clears throat> yes, my lord. Why is the hyperdrive on my shuttle not yet operational? The part is on its way from the distributed... Uh, you have uh, failed me for the last time. Uh, 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 uh. You know, you're not supposed to choke for more than three seconds. Union rules. Yeah, I'll bring it up at the next meeting. That's the end of Tannis. So who wrote that thing about punching his mom in the dick again? I thought that was you. Oh, yeah. Like, I don't know if you guys know, but Tannis took a trip to Choke City. Yeah, Marf was there. No way. Yeah, so he's fully choked out on the ground, right? Which means Jacobs is already getting promoted to lieutenant, which means Revis gets a bump. Wait, so there's an opening on deck crew? Guys, Dark Lord, pure badass. I can't believe you actually saw him. Well, I've seen Dark Lord. So what does he look like? Yeah, wait, so who fills in for Revis on deck crew? I don't know, he's about to yay tall, kind of see-through, kind of blurry. Oh, so you saw the small full body hologram? Yeah, I, I, I saw the big head and shoulders one. So that is pretty badass. So what does he look like? Oh, well, big head, shoulders, blue, blurry. He had a cape. So uh, there's an opening? That's so cool. <laughs> the closest I ever got to Dark Lord was when I got to do some paperwork with his signature on it. I dream about it. Um, Deku exam was in two weeks, if you're interested. <gasps> Where are you going? I gotta study. Oh, and Dark Lord 6-5, Cobalt Black Armor, Durasteel Mask, 53% machine, always. Looks total badass. <laughs> the one swift stroke policy was instrumental in preventing decades of senseless war in all but which of the following rebellions? The Sendarian Slave Revolt, the Prisoners of Peace incidents. The only rebellion that's lasted more than a year is the one that's going on right now. Right. Yeah, I knew that. So, number D then. Correct. Hey, Darby. I've got some files you might want to take a look at. Oh, thanks, Al, but I think I got it covered. Ion fuel engine ratio. Here's your coffee, Darby. <sighs> Can everyone please leave me alone? I need to study. How did you get in here? Oh, I know what's going on. I'm in the test right now. This is the test. I'm sitting in a room with wires plugged into my brain feeding me the questions in context. Right? Right? I don't know. Here's your coffee, Darby. <laughs> All right, I am ready. Bring it on. OK, so you're Correct. lucid testing. So just remember that everything in here is a projection of your own mind. We boarded a rebel frigate to recover some stolen data. That escape pod was just jettisoned. What do you do? Blast it? No, wait, are there life signs on board? No life signs. Protocol doesn't require any action, so C, hold fire and report the escape pod to a commanding officer. Oh, come on! Everybody knows this one. You knew the answer? 
You knew the answer? You didn't tell me? You just pushed me? Yeah. Well, don't! Ow! Stop it. Wait, stop it. Wait. Yeah, you know what? I don't have time for this. Next question. When interfacing with the Mavox systems? Computer psychology. Edith, do you know this one? Sure, let me see. Don't give him the answer. Why? Because he's being a dick. Mike, shut up. Can't you see this test is important to Darby? Okay, let's help him out. It's A. Uh, wrong answer. If you weren't 100% sure, then why did you tell me? I'm gonna fail this test and it's gonna be your fault. I told you he was being a dick. Darby, we're all just projections in your mind. Yeah? Well, in that case, Mike, how's the new uniform? Oh, okay. Darby, what are you doing? What is happening to my voice? Oh, and L, looks like you and me back together. Mm. Guess who's back? Really? This is how it's gonna go down? Test failed. Okay, you know that test where you weren't supposed to blame your friends for your own shortcomings? You failed it, because it's this test. Yeah, geez, Darby, you just had to be responsible for your own answers. Here's your coffee, Darby. So, Darb? How'd it go? Oh, man, that's space garbage. No, it's not space garbage. I screwed up. Okay, so it's a better luck next time party. I made you some sweet mush for you. <laughs> Thanks, guys. It looks great. Trust me, next time, the test is going to be a breeze. Lieutenant Jacobs. Marv, how's this one doing? The test is going well, sir. He's learned his lesson, and it uh, looks like he's going to pass. There's going to be another opening for sure. Excellent. Put him on the short list. All I have to do is wait for Dark Lord to force choke that nerve-hurting dumbass Jacobs. Probably just a... Sorry, there's just a problem with his helmet. I tell you, how that guy got a command, nobody knows. And I even asked the droids, and the droids don't even know. I just... That don't even, that's just subspace interference. That's all that is. <laughs> Check this out, Jake. Jacobs is so no, dumb that he thinks Imperial what? Navy is a color. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, come on, that was funny. Right. So still a janitor then. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.